Hi guys, it's Karis. Welcome back to my channel. I am so excited about today's video because we're gonna talk about holiday looks and how I get ready for a Christmas party, New Year's Eve, all the parties, and also not just fancy look, but casual-ish holiday occasions. And also I'm excited to be sponsored by Nordstrom in this video. You guys all know that Nordstrom is one of my favorite places to shop. And also I encourage you guys to check them out, especially right now, the holiday sales. Mm -hmm. all going on right now. I always love Nordstrom as they have all different types of like massive variety of high-end to low-end, different categories, not just focused on one thing, fashion, but beauty and kitchen, homes, kids, men, women, older, younger, everybody and for anybody. So always you can find something that you're looking for at Nordstrom and I love shopping at Nordstrom because I can tell they put so much effort to make sure that their services are accessible when they're closer to your promise. I've never even heard one person complaining about Nordstrom, their services from my friends, but also from you guys. And I highly recommend you to check out Nordstrom's tailoring service. By simply walking in, you'll find the professional tailor to fix your clothes. Honestly, it doesn't matter how nice or expensive the clothes you have. The fit has to be right in order for you to look good. And they also offer you the stylist to help to pick the right outfit by texting or walking into the store. There's so much more to discover and also get most help from Closer To You campaign at Nordstrom. Also for beauty lovers, currently they're having the five times the reward promotion. Five points for member and 10 points for influencer tier and 15 points for icon member. First part, I want you to help me out which outfit to choose. I have three different places to go. So one, fancy. The second, not so fancy. And the last is more casual. So 10 different looks. So I want you to take this look and tell me and comment below which one you think I should go for. And as always, you can find every item that you see in this video and I mention or talk about. Direct links down below in the description box. Are you ready for 10 different looks? Let's see the first. This jumpsuit is perfect for Christmas, but also it's just screaming for New Year's Eve, isn't it? Also on sale right now, 40% off amazing deal. And the quality is really good, very stretchy and also super comfortable. Only thing I'll say is the front V is just too deep for me. You will really stand out with this. And the second look we have is super chic. I love it. Oh my goodness, this red blazer mini dress from Esther the label looked so good on the model but i honestly didn't really expect much because i just don't have that body you know but i am absolutely loving i do have a few favorites here but this all for sure number one super duper classy but very chic and on the back the fall cut out very nicely done Highly recommend this. It's true to size. The third look is quite pretty. Now we have a nice combination of black, gold, and the pop-up red. This satin blouse with the twist one shoulder. Oh, so loving. It comes also with black, navy blue, silvery color, but red. This is so good, guys. Very high quality and also nicely priced. I was surprised how comfortable it is. The first look is very cute. Isn't this just so me? I love heart. Heart shape is my favorite. This is with off-white with black hearts, but also they have red on red hearts, both of them down below. And I added this pop-up heart bag. So just really cute and sweet look. Crew neck, wool blend sweater, very classy, but just, brings really soft and sweetness with the heart shapes everywhere. Very, very cute. Highly recommend you to take a look. And I got the size small. 
Now I simply just change the top from the sweater to the satin camisole with the faux feather trim from All In Favor. Now I pop on the duster jacket. It is total sequin, very nice cardigan style. So just throw it on. Now I'm switching it off to this really chic and cool looking wool blend coat. It's oversized, nice padding on the shoulder, and this has that trendy touch to the look. Underneath with the feather, it gives that nice fancy um, going to the party look, but throwing on this really chic coat, it just gives nice balance. And here I changed the faux leather. These pants really elevate. I'm so glad these are cropped and I'm only 5'4". I don't have to trim them. It fits me perfectly and true to size. And I'm adding a nice touch of gold to this look. More fancy and more party look. Layered box chain color necklace from Open Added. Nice price. The earrings are not the set, but from the same brand, Open Added. Love that statement look. And I like that color of the cami. It also comes with black, but this mauve pink goes with pretty much everything and looking nice and soft with the coat on for the cooler nights. Pop on the sequin Fendi bag. I love pairing together for the party look. And this metallic sequin top, isn't it? So beautiful. I love that peplum shape. Elastic band and also it has tiny bit of shoulder pads that adds something to it. This sequin top, I must say, it's most comfortable and most wearable. The v-neck is not too deep and also it has the safety pin there so you can just simply pop it on and it secures and has the elastic waistline and also on the sleeve. Very very pretty and I love the color beige silver sequin but also it comes with black and I pop on the same cardigan that you saw earlier on the duster. More <laughs> sparkles. The color is pretty much the same to the top. There is the string underneath where you can cinch in. The duster is very versatile. I highly recommend you to take a look. And also, isn't this sweater just super cute? That little pearls. The little pearls on the sweater looks like little snow. <laughs> everywhere I thought. Switch to handbag to see which one looks the best. And now I pop on this tie bag satin top from Another Stories. I love the color green. Do you see the little details everywhere on the sleeve and the neck and on the back and just all over silhouette, everything nicely made, beautiful design with green. This can be perfect Christmas look, but with that sequin mini skirt, it just totally transforms for perfect for New Year's Eve. Please let me know which look you love the most on me and I should go for it. I'm gonna show you how to get ready right after the shower. But before I do, let me take a bit of time to show you what's inside this huge box. And also it's quite heavy. Oh my goodness, guys. This is amazing. It's like jewelry box. Tintin! Wow, this is magnetic. Big mirror there. This is exact same one as what I have right here. And I talk about this same one in this video, but I'm not gonna open it. Actually, pretty much everything I have. So I got it to gift. I have the same uh, Pillow Talk palette right here it is the brand new i mean it's exact same one but this is the one i've had lighter color nice sheen eyeshadow this sparkle beautifully and these two are matte finish so perfect everyday look everyone needs this oh guys i believe this is the limited edition this is so so beautiful highlighter another highlighter lighter color blush pop-up color blush so gorgeous guys and also the mirror is so big the value if you hear this you're gonna be like oh you need it i'm gonna put the price down here the value and the retail price 
serious must have and i also have both of these matte blush this is really easy to apply you just simply squeeze right here very easy to use you just have to dab it and this is the highlighter and this i have and i used today the highlighter in the middle and you can actually swirl and use together as the blush beautiful glow push up lashes mascara eyelash extension i have so i can't use it but this also i own pillow talk eyeliner it's lip liner pillow talk their pill talk line is just so popular and also this is the pillow talk i see it i have the exact same one and this i also have see like i told you i have the same one that was the first look i used for more soft highly recommend this and i will link to this one down below as well Ta -da! no makeup i'm gonna use my new dyson i got the new special edition which i'm gonna link below beautiful bright blue with the blush pink got that to gift for christmas this i got to give to myself Guys, you know I had the older model and this is upgraded. I really love it. I changed a little bit, just one can do both sides. It's convenient, but also I see the volume and the curl keeps stronger than before. Just gonna change out the top and I'll be back. Dun, 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 dun. I love the sweater. Not just because it's got my favorite shape, hearts everywhere, black and white. And also the sweater is really soft. I don't know where I'm gonna go, but let's start. Get you guys closer. I got this. It was on sale. Ta-da! Super cute. Monica Venere, they're having lots of sale going on right now at Nordstrom. Still love and use my favorite Charlotte Tilbury Magic Cream is the best. I just, before I start putting makeup, I always use this. It blurs and also primes. Skin moisturized. It's not oily. It's not sticky. Lightweight. I thought this was dark circle and that's what I always thought for years. But recently I found out this is sunspot gotten bigger and bigger and deeper now. So that's the sunspot and I want to get rid of it, but because right under my eye, it's dangerous, they said. So I went to two different places to see if they can get rid of it with the laser, but they have to have a, something special to block my eye underneath and yeah, use the laser. So it sounds really harsh. Airbrush Flawless Foundation from Charlotte Tilbury. Number four is a bit too yellow for my little pinky undertone. So I'm gonna use this and mix it together. Clinic. This is like a tinted moisturizer type of loose foundation. And this is my like gel, I'll say. And before I use the foundation, I'm gonna use, picked out two because I didn't know the color. So this is the corrector from Bobbi Brown. And this is the color light peach, which I think it works better than this one. This is a bit darker. Bisque and light peach. Try to have that sunspot. It didn't say concealer. It's more like color corrector. Wow, just dabbing one. What do you guys think? It really helped, right? There's no pump, so I just... Can you guys tell? That's like yellowy, and that's pinky. So I'm just gonna mix them together. The Airbrush Flawless Foundation from Shell Tilbury. It has nice coverage, more than the Kleenex. But the Kleenex is really light, almost like a moisturizer. Looks like I'm putting so much, but... It is just a thin and only one layer. Then I'm gonna just use this. It has really nice coverage with the Shallow Tilbury foundation. So that's the one layer and that's all I'm gonna go for. 
think that's enough. So we put more than I normally do. See that I have the little brush here. This area. Using the little brush, you don't even have to use the product that much. So you're saving the product and also you're targeting on the right that spot that you need. I think that's about it. By the way, I have the eyelash extension. Now I'm gonna set my foundation with Airbrush Flawless Finish Perfecting Micro Powder. You guys saw this before. They have the new one, but I'm still working on it. It stays quite a long time. Do like this. I just dab, dab, dab. More like putting on top of my foundation. Keeps my foundation put. I tend to switch out to other things, but once I know it works, I stick to it. So this is one of those many I love and keep using. So compact and it doesn't go everywhere like the loose fine powder, which I do like and it works well. It just, you have to be careful. It's slim and easy to travel with also. Ta-da! Eyebrows are done. And now, cheek to cheek, this has been around forever and one of the classic from Charlotte Tilbury. Outer is the blush and the middle is the highlighter right here. On your cheeks, you can use it together. Personally, I like to use that blush on my eyes as the eyeshadow. So it's nice to use it when you want to have a pop of color lipstick like red or pink. It's really neutral so it goes with any lipstick that you want to go with but also you can just use it with the nude lipstick, but it's still beautiful. I have three favorite, four different colors. Vintage Vamp. I love that Charlotte Tilbury, they always target neutral. You can use it every day, but also special days. This is the Pillow Talk Everyday Parfait. This is the Pillow Talk also, but luxury palette. But today, like I was talking about this. I want to show you how easy, fast way to use and like I showed you guys before, just get the toilet paper, anything. But the size is just perfect. So I just normally pop it on the mirror and swirl to get the perfect amount, nice amount and dab it. The outer, do you see how pretty that color is? Kind of expand that. To the upper so it opens up your eyes your eyes look bigger it's soft color so it's neutral that's the one time applying and already my eyes got a little bit of defined i used the tiny little and i used that under this color is just really really pretty and soft so i'm gonna show you one that is very very soft you go to holiday party during the day something casual you can do this look with lighter color lipstick or even go with stronger color but your eyes look still really soft and neutral so it doesn't pop as much but i'm going to show you the one that you can go a bit heavier also this is another eyeshadow palette you don't really have experience putting eyeshadow. This is just perfect one, but also everyday look. The first three here for daytime, here three, nighttime. You can also mix them together to use, of course, but here, so pigmented, right? One touch. They're all very useful colors. I'm gonna use this one, the number four. It's almost like putting the eyeliner. And if you want super easy, one and done type of eyeshadow, this is like mousse type of consistency. It's very, very soft, silky. And as you apply, it will dry pretty quickly. And do you see a little sheen? Eyes to mesmerize. This is so nice. You can use the brush, but also you can use the fingertip. Start at the end, spreading out type of motion and go a little bit upper. You can build it up, just one product and it lasts for all day. And this is another one and done type. Of course you can use with something else, but this is pencil style. 
again very easy there you can just done here and go with the lip balm style lipstick this i accidentally stuck right here oh should have not done that this is so good guys you can just use this and you're good to go this is so so easy guys it during the day going and i kept it too long now holiday party that you're going to during the day casual and just meeting your friends and just somewhere small group this will be a beautiful nice just day to day look the sweater here and the look that you saw super cute isn't it perfect to hang out with your friends during holiday season and go to the party it looks really cute and put together but let's switch out to a bit like blingy let's do i'm gonna use this right here to give a bit of pop and defining look and on top also so i'm gonna use this really pretty this one underneath i'm just gonna put it right under the center like half of outer there in the middle of under and using the clean brush to kind of clean up man this color is really pretty but it could become too much if you go too heavy on it got more color i'm just gonna use this with that blush a little bit here i've been using blush more of upper cheek lately oh this is pretty pretty i should use this more often it has a beautiful glow here but still quite neutral right love that a little bit of highlighter there too and sheen so pretty <laughs> look at my hair <laughs> went up okay let's do the eyeliner my favorite tom ford hair right at the end i'm gonna use that as i do this it will soften out the line of the eyeliner also giving another layer of that smoky look And I'm going to use that second one right here. Just dab it. Put it in the middle of my upper eye. Front and the back so it doesn't look like just doop. So when you blink, blink your eyes, you can see it. Really like that. Tiddy! <laughs> exact same face, but pop the earrings. These are very, very inexpensive, but looking very nice, isn't it? Even if you wear something non-holiday looking outfit, pop this type of earrings on or necklace or together. That just adds something to it, looking like you're going somewhere, right? Like more holiday look and look at this top. I love it so much. And I pair it with faux leather looking so good and very, very comfortable. I love that pairing together with this top. It's from Wave. I really love this silhouette. It falls beautifully. Very, very comfortable. I actually popped one flip down the bra and I just still have one on so you can still wear typical or regular bra and just pop one strap down of course green gold silver red they're all perfect color for holiday season but for me yes my favorite color out of those will be the red and with red of course you can go with silver theme together but gold to me looks just perfect like perfection with red gold jewelry pop that on with diamond tea like here and something classy like this dainty little necklace adds something to it and having a bit of jewelry going on another layer of that dressy look for this look you can definitely go with super neutral like nudie lip this one but you could also go with a bra 
some of my favorite Charlotte Tilbury lipsticks. You guys all know how much I love, 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 right? This is just everyday look, coral gate, lost cherry. You guys know I the red, perfect red, and it's matte finish. Of course, it's gonna look perfect with what I am wearing. And this is like a pop of color, electric poppy. This is pillow talk. This is how it looks, pillow talk. But on this, you could use either this to enhance the same color, but also you can kind of tone down lip gloss. I love this, by the way. I didn't mean to, but pretty much everything is from Charlotte Tilbury. The color still stays there, but I literally like the tip. It has two ends like sticking out like a V. So it's easy to apply. There's different shades of pillow talk. This is darker shade, so medium. So this is the look with pillow talk. This to me is more conservative and nice, isn't it? But personally, yes, of course, I love the red. So let's change out red it's called karina's love i like to start with layer it it lasts longer and i kind of smudge it instead of making the whole line with the lipstick and then what i do is to use the brush i don't want to make it too much of the real line my point is not to make the perfect line i want it to be imperfect Trying to give the blurry look. Uh, I'm gonna pick from the pics of yours, so please don't forget to comment below. Even though I went a bit heavier on my eyes than normal days, still they're neutral, right? So I don't think this is too much. With red on red, so loving it. Guys, thank you so much for watching. Check down below if you're interested in the ones I paired with and also what I used on my face and especially this one. This is an amazing gift to yourself and also to give to the ones you love. They're gonna all love. And great value for what you're paying for. So highly recommend that. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'm gonna see you guys in my next video. Bye.